How you feeling today? Uh, anxious. Anxious. Well, today. talk about partnering with your partner that's a part of uh, some people's business but not everybody's business yeah some people um, you know have uh, outside individuals that they may have went into business with or mm -hmm. they decided to enterprise with but we decided to work together mm -hmm. so it's something that I know you feel a certain way about based on the fact that how you see a relationship and how it unfolds over the time of a, of a, of a business or a working relationship right yeah so you know People do partner with their partners or go into business with um, their significant other. And, you know, it. people think, oh, you work with your partner? It's not uh, butterflies and <laughs> rainbows every day. It's hard, um, and it takes work. Or well, I feel it takes work to, you know, you are with this person at work all day. Mm -hmm. Then you you know you got to switch hats and then you're home and sometimes the uh, lines get blurred and you're you should be you should post you should be focusing on home life or personal time but of course business creeps in there and you know it can it can be frustrating from time to time and uh, like anything it takes work you have to learn how to set boundaries and you know I've been trying to do that and say that, but uh, doesn't always uh, work out. Because in my head, I want to set, okay, at a certain time, we're done with work or whatnot. But for us and owning your own business, there is really no, there's no downtime. Like it's all together. Um, so sometimes you have to separate. Um, and we've had that discussion before, like we need to separate, you know, home life or personal time from work. But, you know, like I said, when when it's yours and, and your, it's your business, it's hard to do that mm -hmm. or whatnot. So, you know, it's just, it, it takes a lot of work. Um, Cause I, I try my best, <laughs> but it does not always, happen to where if you if something happens at work and I'm frustrated or annoyed at work I try my best not to you know when it's personal time or when we're done with work to let that you know seep over into that how I'm feeling seep over into that personal time but sometimes it don't work I'm only yeah. human um or whatnot and it, and it'll start with Okay, I may be frustrated at something at work, and then something may happen on personal time, and then it, the frustration just builds, and you know, it becomes an unfriendly environment. Mm -hmm. You know, and you gotta, you have to work on it or whatnot. And you know, I'm still working on it. It's not something that well, somebody can perfect. In, we'll you we'll know. always be working on it. Mm -hmm. I'm working on it too. Like you said, um, well, I mean, you can't see it because, you know, like you said, you're doing business, right? Mm -hmm. But then, like you said, your day-to-day -day lives and, and our day-to-day -day operations, you know, um, 
it it can become blurry sometimes because like you said, you may be frustrated about something. I may be frustrated about something, but you know, it's not the same thing. It's, and it's not in the same context. Yeah. So I have to, I have to, I'm going to say have to, and I'm not putting this on a particular thing right now. I'm saying in, as a, as a person, as a, as a being, I have to develop and do better because that is the scenario that we mm -hmm. in. So for me, you know, I have to see, um, like where this is and then where this is as far as life is concerned. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? So you you could have a, a incident or a situation and you'll say this, this, and this. Mm -hmm. And at work it is. But then we have <laughs> we still together. So now we not working. And I may still be thinking this, this, and this. And I'm like, nah, it ain't like that. But you could be in a whole different context now. Yeah. And it's not like we're like, all right, we clock out. You, yeah. you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. It's not like all of a sudden you look at me, I look at you, and like, yeah, we clocked out. Now we on some uh, relationship. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but, I mean, I guess if you could do that, yeah. right? You, you, you should be like, all right. We set our timers on our clock, on our watches, I mean, on our phones, and be like, at five thirty. It look, I could be, you know, you know, remember that cartoon where the dog and the uh, the uh, the wolf or whatever they be fighting every day, <laughs> and then he about to punch him, and then the clock go off, and he be like, all right, Sam, all right, <laughs> and then the other <laughs> ones come and they finish it. Yeah, you have to think like that, like yeah. all right, you saying this and. I ain't even saying this is true. Let's just give it as an example. I can be doing something. I'm fixing a tire. And you say, fix that tire. And then it's 530. Like, all right, man, the tire ain't. So now the anger that you feel towards fix that tire, <laughs> now you got to let that go until tomorrow yeah. morning and be like, all right, get back on that tire. But yeah. if you with somebody, you can't, in your brain, <laughs> you can't just stop work. You're like, man, you, man look, you should have fixed that tire. Like, man, that was at work, man. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. But, I guess you have to. <laughs> you sitting there watching TV like, that's not. Why you ain't fixed that time? You know what I'm saying? So it's like you have to like, I don't know, but you, and, but then as people, we have to see that, right? Yeah. I have to see that, you know, okay, you, you're doing the HR and I'm doing the mechanical stuff. So now you, you're on the computer typing and you're like, did you do this? Did you do that? You do this. And I could be like, man, I'm off, man. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? But I can't because we still together, right? Mm -hmm. And it's not a... It's just something that if you're going to do it, you have to learn it. And then you have to start learning your way around it. You got to like the person you're doing it with. Right. <laughs> right. Point blank, period. You have right. to like right. that individual. Yeah. Right. Oh, that's my husband. I love him. Right. Do you like him? Right, right, right. That you, you have to get to that point in your relationship. You need to know... Okay, you got to realize you're going to be with this person 24 All day. 7. All day. Every day. <laughs> All day. <laughs> and, you know, it's, you know, not to, it, it, it can become right. frustrating and overwhelming. Especially if you have a certain mentality of you need to do everything. Right. And I think I get... When I get overwhelmed, that's because I, I, I've, I've put too much on my plate myself mm -hmm. um, or whatnot. And sometimes that frustration is towards you. Yeah. You get it because you're in close proximity of me yeah. and we're always together. Mm -hmm. You know, and that's why it comes to that point to where you have to like that person mm -hmm. or whatnot. Um, because no relationship is easy. Right. But going into business with your significant other, it can put a strain on your relationship. Or it will put a strain on that. And I can say it could. It will. Because you like, oh, I love him. I love being with him. It, you're going to get frustrated on at, at some point. Yeah, you can have 30 days of bliss. But then you have that, you know, that one day you're like, man, look, bro. Yeah. Look. Like and, it, saying, and it goes both ways. Like you're saying, so it could be anything. Yeah. I can only speak for me, 
what I have to do, what I have to understand mm -hmm. more times than not. Because you could be saying something or you could be doing something. And this is just regular stuff. It ain't, got, it ain't no specific you know, situation. But you could be saying something or something. And in my mind, I have to say, well, I say it and I do it. You know, and I'm like, this not the HR lady. That's my boo, man. That's my boo, right? Yeah. But in my brain, I have to do that because you the same person. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? So, I can't be mad at my my boo, but I'm mad at the HR lady. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? The HR lady got on my nerves. <laughs> but it's the same person, right? Yeah. So I can't, but I, so I can't be like, get off me, yeah. because my boo didn't do this to me, <laughs> right? The HR lady told me I had to go do something, and I didn't do it, right? So I can't be like, get off me, because they're not the same person. <laughs> you know, yeah, it's, you know. it's the same person, but it's not the same a person. Different hat, but yeah, so, the hat off. Right. So you can't go in there and cook, and I'll be like, it's nasty because I'm mad at the HR lady. <laughs> If it's good, you know it's good. It's still I should, delicious. I should buy some different hats. Like HR. <laughs> yeah. um, mommy, they right. take the hat off. Uh, chef, you know, just right. different hats. Right. That, that'll be funny. But so, you know, you, you come to me. That's something. Just be like. <laughs> <laughs> okay, who am I right now? Put on the hat, huh? <laughs> but that's the thing, you know. That's something that you, you get in the business or you do something. And that's another aspect that. You know, it's not talked about or understood about, yeah. right? Because you with this person, y'all together, but at the same time, you got to know, all right, she didn't do this. But then I can't be, you. Get, but then I can't think too, oh man, that ain't really the HR lady. That's my boo. She <laughs> doing that on purpose. You doing that on purpose. You ain't the HR lady right now. <laughs> but and, I'm saying if yeah. somebody could do that in their yeah. mind and... and be like, oh man, that ain't you ain't doing this ain't the rules you doing, you doing this personally. Yeah, right? or or flip flop and yeah. then you we not had a disagreement on something personal, but then we gotta go to work. Right. Or something at work needs to happen and it's like, you know, we ain't speaking. Right. And then it's like, oh I gotta call him. Right. You see what I'm saying? So <laughs> right. it go both <laughs> It go both ways. Like you you like I said, you have to like that person. You gotta love the business that you're doing. Yeah. Cause you know, I I feel me personally, that when we have we have more disagreements when they come on the work side mm -hmm. than we do on the personal side. Yeah. I mean, but when we do have a disagreement on the personal side, it is hard to work with you. Because yeah. I don't want to talk to you. Yeah. But I got to talk to you. Yeah. <laughs> we, this is our livelihood. Yeah. This is our business. So I, I have to be like, all right. I have to tell myself, what are you doing? You, you need to call me. Yeah. But I realized I have to call you before I have to call you. I'm like, oh, well, let me figure it out myself. Yeah. But then I'm like, man, I got to call you. Because I, I, I need, I can only get so far because it's like with the business, we can't function without each other. Right. You see what I'm saying? Right. So I can only get so far and then I'm like, I got to call him. Right. And then I have to call you because I, I can't solve the problem or come up with the solution I may need because yeah. I don't have all the information. Right. I only got the 50% of it right. and you got the other 50% and, see, and I got to get thing. it from you. And, and so, like you're saying, as we're talking, it develops even more because we have to say, well, between us, we have to make sure that we know the things, right? You do HR, you do relations, whatever. I do strategies, strategies tactics how we gonna move, how we gonna operate, right? Operations, right? So we're looking, we have to look at it from those standpoints, but that's what makes it good and makes it mm -hmm. able to work because you know your job clearly is defined and what my job is is clearly and defined. So even if I'm upset or whatever, I know what my job is and mm -hmm. I know what it means to what it is that we do, right? Mm -hmm. But that's these are things that, before working or before doing this, we didn't know. We, mm -hmm. we you know, you, you like you say, like we always say, and we always gonna say, it, when you turn on the Instagrams, when you turn on the Facebooks, mm -hmm. when you turn on the social medias, you get what I'm saying? And if, yeah. you, if you start your business or you think that you 
it's just going to be that. Then you have to look at all the dynamics that come into what you're doing. Yeah. Because if you if you're going to work with with your significant other or whatever, then you have to understand. You can't understand it. That's the first part because mm-hmm. you, you don't know it, right? You don't know business first of all, yeah. and then you don't know how all of this plays out in an everyday scenario. Yeah. You like you said with 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 life. You, you it's nobody's. Right now, I mean, now maybe it is a book on it. We, yeah. we didn't know, or uh, we still don't know. Maybe we need to look it up. But at this point, we don't really need the book because at this point, we writing the book. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but to know it and to come across it mm-hmm. is, you know, like you're saying in everyday life, man. We how many arguments and how many times we ain't talking to each other at the house, but when we get to work. <laughs> We got to talk to each other, you know, how many times, yeah. you know, and until you start learning that that's not the same thing, mm-hmm. it's, 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 I don't know if you could call it sick or what, but <laughs> you have to, you have to see it some type of yeah. way, like, you know, and it's just a thing that you have to come across and like you said, you have to work through yeah. it. Yeah. You have to work through it because... First of all, like you said, if you like the person, then you're going to be like, you know what, that is my boo. Let me try to, f- what was I doing? Yeah. You get what I'm saying? Because if not, like just at work, and if it was just at a regular job, I'd be like, man, I don't like Viola, man. Yeah. I don't like her, period. <laughs> if she come and tell me something, I ain't, I, I don't care. I ain't doing it. They're going to fire me. Mm-hmm. But I, I don't even have that option. No. Right? So I had to say, man, then I, in my brain, that is my boo. She might be right. I, let me see. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I, you get what I'm saying? Because in my brain, you have to, you have to have something. Be, but see, at work, you might say, well, you don't like the HR lady, but you know what? Man, I did tell my old lady, I'm going to take her to the mall. I'm going to take, yeah. take her here and there. So I can't quit the job. You, yeah. you, you would have something still that would motivate you to yeah. work through that issue at work. Yeah. So you have to have that same motivation mm-hmm. at home. Yeah. If if we're gonna work together, then I still have to say, man. Well, you know what? She is right. Maybe I should have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe yeah. I should have went to to the to to uh, the mechanic shop at at nine o'clock. Yeah. Maybe I should have been there. You get what I'm saying? Or yeah. maybe I should have. You know, she right. You know what? Hey, you know what? You right. I I was late. I shouldn't have been late. <laughs> You get what I'm saying? You have to, you have to find that thing. And if, and if, like you said, if you like the person mm-hmm. and you really enjoy being around them, we could be the silence treatment. But at at some point, we still gonna wanna, you know, that's my yeah. buddy. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's my, that's my, uh, you know, when we go, that's my Costco buddy, man. Mm-hmm. That's, that, you know what I'm saying? That's still that's still my my um my Sam's buddy, man. Go to Sam's, walk around Sam's. That's my farmer's market uh partner, man. I, <laughs> let me figure out where where like my man said, where did we go wrong? <laughs> let me find out where this went wrong so we can so we can go on down to the farmer's market and walk around. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Really and, you know. But that's a part of it and like you're saying, even even further when we go and say, you doing HR, I'm doing tactics and strategies. Now, um, I come up with an idea to, uh, for operation. You you may be like, I don't I don't see it that way. Now that's work. But then when we come home and I come up with a strategy or a tactic, and you say I don't want to do it that way, then I can be like, but see, even when that work, you do this. <laughs> You see what I'm saying? But it's not the same, right? But you do, you will do it. You know, yeah. you, 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 people will do it. You know, what because I'm you're not gonna agree on everything right, right. when it comes to, you know, business and and personal. Right. Yeah, you may start out that way, like okay, I'm gonna agree. Yeah, but then you get to where you're like, I don't understand, or I don't want to do it that way, and then right. it becomes a disagreement right. or whatnot, and it's just like. Sometimes you can, a disagreement at work or what you're supposed to be doing for your business 
and then you get home and you start putting that stuff together and then you get upset more and more and then you have to realize like wait a minute that ain't got nothing to do with that right. so it is you you have to do that internal work to make sure you separate it if right. not it, it's it's everywhere it's just mm -hmm. it's disagreements everywhere it's disarray everywhere yeah right because like like we talking that you got workflow and then you got home flow mm -hmm. so you know at work, I, let's say I construct the workflow. We do this, we do this, we do this, we do this, we do this. When you come home, you construct the home flow. I'm finna cook, I'm finna do this, I'm finna do this, I'm finna do this. Now, at the workflow, you be like, I don't know, whatever. And then I come home and I, I can be like, well, you don't like mine, I don't like your workflow. Mm -hmm. But you can't do that because those are two completely. You can, but it should be petty as hell. Right, be but, <laughs> right, but those are two completely. <laughs> But I can if I'm bad as you 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 messed up my day, I'm gonna mess up your yeah. day, right? Yeah. <laughs> you can as petty. Yeah. I wouldn't do it, because I'm not petty. But don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not petty. I'm not petty. I'm like, you know what? That's alright. That's alright. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and do it anyway. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But it, it is, you know, and have I done it? No. But do you, but does it come to you? Yes. Because mm -hmm. you're like, man, well, when I tell you stuff, you don't, you, you, you. but that's a different thing. Mm -hmm. It's completely different. You're at home. You know what I'm saying? This is your life. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Now, if I say, I ain't going to do this, or I ain't going to do that, then, right, how are you going to cook? Yeah. If if I don't go to get the the chicken feet, oh, not the chicken feet. That's you eating them chicken feet all the time. We but if, if you don't want me, if you if you want me to go get the chicken leg or what, you know whatever it is. Oh, I forgot I forgot the onions. Could you go get the onions? Why well, I gotta go get the onions? You supposed to have this order now. You supposed to. I called you and said I was coming home and you could have told me then. But that ain't the point. The point is is this flow is different than that flow. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? And if you not seeing it in a in a way that you can, you know, where they sometimes people say compartmentalize, mm -hmm. but people always vilify the idea of compartmentalizing things, but some things you do have to. Not saying everything, but something like that, you would have to. You have to say, okay, well, you know what, you're right. Okay, what do you want from the store? Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? As opposed to being like, well, how come you ain't had a list? How come you ain't had this? How come mm -hmm. you ain't had that? Because even though I seen you all day, because we working together, <laughs> I got to take into consideration, it's just like, say, if you wasn't here all day mm -hmm. and you was at a job, you didn't have time to come up with the list. Yeah. Even though I saw you, and yeah. I know I saw you, but you're working, yeah. just like I'm working. So, <laughs> you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. I, I know that I seen you, mm -hmm. but that I'm not seeing you in a free capacity. Yeah. I'm seeing you in a working capacity. Yeah. So you didn't have time to say, oh, I need chicken leg, I need onions, I need this, I need that. Yeah. You didn't have that until you got off of work. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? So now you at the house and you're like, oh, I don't got onions. I don't got this, I don't got mm -hmm. that. But I can't say, well, I seen you standing around doing nothing because <laughs> you could have been thinking about... <laughs> You could have been thinking about something that you need, a, 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 you know, an email you need to send yeah. or somebody send you, you get what I'm saying? Yeah. So, yes, I see, I'm see. i seeing you, but I'm all, I'm seeing you at work. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? Because, you know, we, we've we had that issue where, or I have, do I be messing with you? Uh, yeah. Because, like, with any significant other, a significant other that you may be, you know, living with, and it's like us in the trash. Like, I'm always bothering you about the trash. I'm like, take the trash out. Then we get to work, and then you be doing something. I'm like, why you take that trash out? <laughs> <laughs> like, I can see you, and sometimes do I do it to message you? Uh, yeah. Like, you be doing something, laughing with your friend, well, the, the your teammates, or, you know, changing the tire or whatever. And I'm like, let me go ahead and message you. Then I go over and I start talking to you. 
And I wait for my opportune moment to be like, why you take that trash out? You know you left that trash this morning, you left the house. Right, right. And then you always give me that look. But it'd be funny to me, because I know I'm messing with you. <laughs> but see, that's the that's the both sides of it. Like, okay, yeah, you know what? That's just like saying the same as somebody say that they sent a text. What you have to think of it like uh -huh. that, even though I'm looking at you physically and I'm talking to you, it's the same as, like, say if I was changing that tire and, I, and you sent the text, I'd be like, oh, yeah, I did. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but it's, it's all of those things are happening yeah, simultaneously. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? So you have, and so then you can't be like, when you was bothering me, because we still together. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? And it's it's work to to blend it all together. Yeah. And you know, you get but at, once you create the the flow and once you create the languages and you understand between each other, okay, well she's not talking about this, she's talking about that, mm -hmm. she's not talking about this, she's not talking about that. You have to but like you said, you have to wanna do it. Mm -hmm. I have to I have to wanna understand what's happening. Mm -hmm. You know, I have to wanna, I have to wanna not lose sight of my friend, mm -hmm. my partner. I have to not lose sight of all these people that I'm talking to, <laughs> my gym buddy. You know what I'm saying? Because one thing can mess up all of these things, the whole right? Day mess up. So now. <laughs> Now I done lost my I done lost my cook, I done lost my <laughs> I done lost my gym partner, I done lost my work partner, uh -huh. I done lost my work wife, yeah. my home wife, my gym <laughs> wife. I done lost look, I done I done messed up five, I done messed up six relationships <laughs> that quick. You see what I'm saying? So yeah. it's it's something that you have to, you know, you have to it's not, you know, it's a, as they say, it's a labor of love, yeah. right? You have to say, all right. But like I said, at first we we couldn't. Dude, we didn't know, man. We, we, Look, and bro. we still working on it. Yeah, you know what it, I'm saying? It, but at first it boy, we couldn't. It's we every couldn't it's see. every day is a new day, and every day is continue to work at it. When we first like started, it was in it was one blur. It was blur. <laughs> it bro, was one man, blur. look here. How you it say? Was, how many times have them broken up in our head? Right. It was, like, it was man, one blur. It was hard. It was one blur. Duh. It was one blur. Hard. Because you got everything so intertwined, right. there is no separation. That's why you have to get to that point where, okay, it's not going to be perfect, but we need to figure out what is what right. or whatnot. Because if not, we ain't, this, this, this ain't, ain't going to work. This ain't going to work. Ain't gonna work. And, yeah. you know, people got the, and like you said, everybody in business is not going to have this yeah. scenario. But for people who do, this is a part of it because all of those people are, mm -hmm. we, we are all of those people yeah. for whatever reason. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm the person you talk to. I'm the person you're going to mm -hmm. ask me about cooking. I'm the person you don't, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So, you know, you have to develop that tolerance for different things at different yeah. moments. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because um, you could just, you know, be like, well, you asking me, I can't say, yeah, well, I, oh man, I, I'm tired of giving you advice on cooking. How can I do that? Because I'm the person that you test in the food. Yeah. You, you understand? Like, you can't take things, now you can do it, Yeah. but, you know, this is still the same person, so... You have to, and after a while, really now it's not even a moving in and out of different different people or mm -hmm. different mentalities. It's you know yeah. this 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 is the this is the person that I'm doing this stuff with. Yeah. So you know you you show the compassion or the sympathy at yeah. you know varying degrees throughout all the activities. Mm -hmm. But they all happening in one day, mm -hmm. but they're happening at, you know, at different intervals, you know. At this time, all right, now, we walking in, we walking in the meeting together. We like, all right, we gonna do what we do. You tell you, yeah, right, yeah, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Get them boys, yeah, yeah, yeah. you know what I'm saying? And you walk out, 
man, I don't want to do now. Now we on to something else. Yeah. I don't feel like eating this today. I don't. You get what I'm yeah. saying? But just a second ago, we was together. Showing unity. Right. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We was just together fussing the station out. Yeah. We was just together doing this. Now you want, I want wings, <laughs> and you don't want wings. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Or we could be at work and, you know, in our environment, there's different people. Right. And we have to keep it professional. Right. But sometimes I can lose sight of that story time. We was having a meeting, a team meeting, group meeting, discussing some things that we needed to relate to the team. And out of the blue, a random young lady walks through our meeting, through our group, just to give this gentleman right here, hi, how you doing? It seemed like he got no, that's how he was looking. I'm, he, I'm, I'm, I'm just as uh, you surprised <laughs> as you are. And me being the HR the relations person, and you know, I'm giving the meeting, but another hat switch, wife steps in like, so she don't see nobody else standing here. She walked through to me just to, hey, how you doing? Touch his arm and all types of stuff. And I'm like, wait a minute, hold up. So, you know, our team knows that we are together. We're partners. So everybody instantly looks at me. <laughs> I stop talking because I'm like, you know, could I act up? Yes. Should I? No. Because at the end of the day, we are in a place of business. Right. Someone else disrespect shouldn't take you to uh Here's the thing. This is what I'm saying. Me, I'm at work. My HR is right here. That lady uh, accosted me. <laughs> and my HR didn't do nothing. <laughs> you understand me? I was assaulted. Uh -huh. That lady imposed uh, uh, interpersonal stuff onto me while I'm at work. <laughs> Uh -huh. My HR should have done something about that, uh -huh. but she didn't. Because she was acting up <laughs> right. uh, too uh, right. Right. inappropriately. She was in a different context. Yeah. She should have saw this person <laughs> making me uncomfortable in the work environment. <laughs> and she should have stepped in and said, we can't do this here at work. That's uh -huh. inappropriate behavior. Why did you do this to this man? Uh -huh. But I couldn't. There wasn't nothing I could do because, you understand me? I can't do nothing to this young lady. But hey, lady, look, lady. Hey, lady. It's uh -huh. inappropriate. Uh -huh. You understand me? So, you know. That, I, I, I might have needed the Me Too moment. Because, you know, I'm just trying to do my job. Uh -huh. Get my team out for the day. And that's where the HR is like, okay, what a, you know. You saw the incident. incident. I saw the incident. I, you know, and so, but here, even with that incident. Let's say you wasn't there. And I try to convey that information to you as, as my old lady. You might say, oh, why was she have done that? But you was there to see it. So yes. I was just standing there. And, but but right. my thing That's is. That's a good thing. No, 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 no. But it makes me. But now HR has left the building. And wifey has stepped in. And like, so why so, is she so friendly right, with you, you to see it? it? So I I'm just here. I talked before. I, I don't know. I, do. I got the same information you got. Uh -huh. I was standing here telling people. Where they gotta be, what time they gotta be, and this person just imposed her will on this scenario. You seen it, wasn't me. But my question is now I need to investigate on how often is she, hey, how you doing? Hey. I'm not there constantly. You, you but you witnessed the scenario. <laughs> that one, but not <laughs> right. the other you one. The, you witnessed this person's propensity <laughs> to force themselves onto these scenarios. Uh huh. All I can do is defend myself. How you doing, ma'am? Okay. Right on. That's all I can do. Mm -hmm. No more. But good thing my HR was there. Uh -huh. So I don't so when if something happened, she could say she was a witness and if I need to get something stamped and notified, I can go straight to the HR <laughs> and say this happened on this day at this time, I got a witness. You see what and I'm see, saying? that's where the separation comes in. <laughs> Because he be joking and trying to make the light of the situation, which he should, not to do. keep uh, wifey at bay so HR lady can continue on with the meeting. 
or whatnot. But, you know, you, you run into those type of situations and, you know, we laugh and joke about it. Um, I mean, it wasn't funny at the time. I was uh, highly, felt highly disrespected, but that's neither here nor there. But stuff like that can occur. And, you know, just... You have to have foresight. You have to have yeah. some type of vision, some type of wherewithal to see various things are going to happen. That's work. Yeah. You know. and, and trust in there or whatnot. So, you know, you got you to gotta trust your partner. But it the bottom line, it falls back to do you like this person? Do you like being around this person? Because you're going to be around them all the time. But not, like nothing is always perfect. Some things are, but relationships are. Somebody say, oh, my relationship perfect. Or they on the internet. Oh, it's so perfect. Oh, I love working with. Them on a day that you're not happy. Or y'all not, you know, in sync with what, what's going on for the day or how you're feeling. Um, but on the other hand, it is fun working with your partner. Yeah. Especially because... When you work it out and you got the flow, yeah, and you we have the rhythm, and yeah. when we in rhythm and we in sync, it is fun. Yeah, everything is, everything is fun. You know, you, you go, oh man, we going, and it might seem silly, but it is right. We go to Costco or we go to Sam, <laughs> and we walking around talking, just yeah. I, I don't know what the, you know. We go, oh, let's go to the new coffee shop. Oh, yeah. Let's go over here. Let's go. Yeah. You know, and oh, so we got a meeting on this side of town. Yeah. What what's over there? Yeah, I don't yeah. know. Let's let's see. Let's yeah. you know. Oh well, you know what? Today we going next town over. We got to pick up some checks. We got to go yeah, do this. Yeah. When we go, oh, you know what? That restaurant that's over yep. there. Let's go. You know what I'm saying? So it's it's it has it's everything is there for you, mm -hmm. but the work part. You have to work through it and you have to construct it to where when you get to the personal parts of it, you can enjoy it. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Because the work part, if you don't know, you know what? That's something. That's something right there. If you don't know somebody, for me, a lot of times, you can get to know somebody when you work with them. Because yeah. you're going to know that. You're going to know the actual person. Yeah. You're going to know if this person is, is the type of to lie, if you if this person is the type to cut corners, yeah. if this type if this is the type of person to cover stuff up, mm -hmm. because when you work with them, you're gonna see them at the point where they're trying to get the mm -hmm. stuff that they want. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? So yeah. when I seen you working, I knew we could we could work together because mm -hmm. I seen your you know, the way you cared about what you was doing and mm -hmm. how it affected you, like, how you took the task. Yeah. And the same, you know, so I'm like, you know what? She just trying to do her job. I could know that you yeah. was just trying to do the right thing. I could know it. I, I could see you not cutting the corners. I could see yeah. you not. So when you saying something, I, I know not to take it personal because I know you're trying to do the right thing. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Because I see you working. Mm -hmm. So I see you you filling out paper. I see you not cutting corners. I, so when you doing something in a work capacity or you saying something to me in a work capacity, then I know mm -hmm. that you're trying your best to make sure it's right. Mm -hmm. Even though it may have made me mad, I know, well, you know, she, you know, yeah, she's doing... The and and I've, I've had to learn that too because... You know, like you'll be at the job and then you'll call me for something. And then I'm like, why are you just going to figure that out on his own? But I know you need the information that I have to make an informed decision on, right. on what needs to be decided upon. And, you know, so like I used to be like, well, he, he's the owner. He could, you could have made a decision without me. Right. But I know you need, a, you know, then it got to the problem. Okay, no, because he don't know if this person work on this day or what right. should happen. So, you know, it's, it it becomes a more of an understanding and in a flow. Right. Oh, it not in. You know, it's like I said, you have to like that person and you have to love what you're doing. Right. Um, for us, it just worked out perfect for us or whatnot. Um, because I like being around you. Well, likewise. But, um, like you said, 
for me, what made, like you saying, what made it, uh, like you say, love what you're doing, it, what makes it, it me, because I just don't care where I work or what I do. I just want it to work. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? And when you go places, you you have things to deal with, things outside that's external. Yeah. Dealing with people, dealing with this, dealing with that. I know you and I'm with you. Mm -hmm. So all I have to figure out is what's happening with you. Yeah. I've got to figure out what's working, happening with the boss, what's happening with this person, what's happening. Because mm -hmm. at a regular job, you have to deal yeah, with those yeah, yeah, things. Yeah. So now I just have to deal with one person and then I can go and do my job. I can go and do what I need to do. Mm -hmm. I don't have to, whatever. Okay, that then I, I'm cool. Sign me up. Let me work. Just yeah. let me work. You mm -hmm. see what I'm saying? And that's what makes it possible for me to yeah. interact, you know, the way we do. Because, like, so people be like, you love what you do. And I'm like, look, man, I, it's work. Oh, well, you know, I, I... And some people are that way. They have to... If they go and start a business, it has to be something personal to them. Mm -hmm. It doesn't... Work is not personal to me, so I don't care what work it is. Mm -hmm. As long as I can go and do it, I don't care. I, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, I, 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 I paint cars and this is my passion in life. No, I'll paint them. Is it my business? And is my boo going to do the paperwork? Well, I, all right, then I want to paint cars. You see what I'm saying? It's that easy to me because it's yeah. work. You see yeah. what I'm saying? I'll do the work. The work mm -hmm. doesn't bother me. Because for me, it's all the extra stuff that people bring to work. Yeah. Once I figured out how to remove that, and now I, with that being said, it doesn't make, all of those things that you move from people, like uh, the people may have stereotypes or whatever that they may think about us individually, you know, just at any job, mm -hmm. you know, pre uh, prejudices or, you know, whatever things at jobs, you know, like, Mm -hmm. Oh man, these people don't like me at work. I've removed all of that and and replaced it with maybe my old lady moves, swings, how she feel. Cause you don't have those prejudices against me. You're yeah. not stereotyping me. You're not, you know, doing those things that I removed all those things from my workplace mm -hmm. and replaced them with a person. And so when I replace it with the person, the things that used to make me feel some type of way at work. I've replaced them with you mm -hmm. and what you're doing and what you're saying. And though, so now we go back to partnering with your partner. So it's yeah. like, now, oh, that's my old lady. Now I have to know she's doing HR, but yeah. she's not doing it to me. She is right. I should be doing it this way. Mm -hmm. I, you get what I'm saying? Because when I'm at work, I can be mad at the HR lady. Man, she can't tell me what to do. But... Between us, I know that you're yeah, doing yeah. what we supposed to be doing. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. And now I just need to make sure I'm doing that and then do my job. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. So that's why, at least from my standpoint. Now, from your standpoint, how did it? How did that? Well, you know, with me, with my personality, I am one of those people. I need to like what I'm doing, right? Or whatnot. So that's where we we differ. That's why if someone, you know says something negative about us, I take it personally. And right. I need to get to the bottom of it. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. I need to know who started, who said this, why they said it. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. And you're just like, well, there's nothing we can do now. We can only move forward. Uh, no. <laughs> I need to see. I need to know why. Right. I need to know who said this. Right. Because I need to get this person in front of me. Right. And you need to explain to me why you said this. Right, right. You see right. what I'm saying? I take it personally because I love Right. What we do, and like I say, right. our business is, is my baby or whatnot. And I right. want to make sure whatever we're doing or whatever we decide to do that is running like it's supposed to be running. And, and you know, our reputation is what it needs to be. Right. Um, you know, and I, for when it comes to you, I know you will work. You see what I'm saying? I know if it needs to get done physically or anything, I know you'll take care of it. Um, I like bossing you around. Ah. <laughs> I know, I know you'll you'll get it done or whatnot. You may not want to do it some uh, a, a specific task or anything like that, and you know you may grit your teeth or roll your eyes and look 
you know, whatever. But I know you're going to get it taken care of or mm-hmm. whatnot. Do you do it in the timely manner that I like? No. And that's why we get both get uh, have disagreements because for me, I am in your learning over, over, over the time. I am a stickler for time or I try to be. You know, sometimes, you know, we can do it. It's out of control. Or, you know, something may happen. And, you know, in my brain, I'm like, all right, we're not going to get there on time. Whatever this may happen. But just, I, okay, we need to be there at a certain time. I want to be there or be a little early. You, and we get there when we get there. And that's where. Because in those, <laughs> in those moments, <laughs> you know, now I say, now nah, I'm saying this because I always say, well, uh, I like to work. You do the business. Mm-hmm. Well, when it come in them moments, I, I, I'm the boss. I get there when I feel like it. You know, so you, that's how I'll be feeling in them moments. Like, uh-huh. man, they waiting on us. Yeah. You know, but we shouldn't because we still have to understand yes. the business of it. Mm-hmm. But in them moments, hey, yeah. man, I'm going to do my flex, man. I show it. I'm the boss, man. I show it when I feel like it. Yes. I know we, but sometimes I I want to do it too. Sometimes I want to, hey man, look man, look bro. You know what I'm saying? Me? Uh, you know, nobody tell me nothing. Nobody don't tell me nothing. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I want to get mine off too. You know what I'm saying? But I know that you know we do we do need to keep schedules. We uh-huh. do need to keep. But sometimes you think, well, why do I own a business if I can't be late? Even though it's now that's childish. <laughs> But you shouldn't you shouldn't be doing it, right? You shouldn't be, ah oh, man, I can be late if I want to. Cause in business that doesn't make sense. It doesn't. Because everybody's got a schedule. Uh-huh. Not just us. Mm-hmm. Whoever we meet in with, they yeah. have schedule, they have other if if you own a business, then you know. Mm-hmm. So why would I come and be like, Well, I'm I'm the boss, I can do what I want to do, but you know, sometimes, you have. sometimes you know, Yeah. Sometimes you know, we do it. We shouldn't do it. Mm-hmm. But you know, I get it. I get it. You know, and I do mm-hmm. try to stay on time, <laughs> and I do stay on time. But you know, and for what you want to do, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, of course. For you, you are when it comes to your what time you get up in the morning, what time you doing. You know, you got your your set time down. But yo, you on time. <laughs> It ain't no question. <laughs> uh, we, we need to leave this on. Bro, you have it mapped out. We, looking at the clock, you, you be on point. The minute I say we got to be here, ah, we need to get that one. Bro, are you saying, <laughs> what? Yeah. <laughs> but, so so yeah, you it's got time. It's time. Yeah, you, it's you, you, time be on, you be on point. You yeah. be, by the second, you be, yeah. you be on it. Yeah. Uh-huh. But, you know, in, in those type of things, you know, you can, well, I said you've gotten way better or whatnot. So, you know, it's, like I said, you got to like the person you're in business with yeah. or whatnot. If you're like, oh, I love my husband or I love my wife or I love but my that don't mean you can work with That them. don't mean you can work with that person. <laughs> <Right>. mm-hmm. <laughs> because, like you said, when, like I was saying, when that's something that I learned. You know a person when you work with them. Yeah. Because... That's how they get their food, water, yeah. and shelter. Uh-huh. And if they if they the type to cut corners, that's who you really dealing with. Yeah. D- this is who you really dealing with. Mm-hmm. They can't hide this. You know if your man or your old lady go in the refrigerator and leave the top off the milk right. or right. never if close the container them, down. You know they this type close of person. Close the, con- the sealed container back. You know, leave one sock here right, and right. do not don't go into business. Don't do it. <laughs> love love that person for them. Right. Do not put your livelihood with right. them because you guys will butt heads and, and right. the business will right. fall apart. Right. Right. You just gotta figure out what you're willing to do. If you pick up after this person and you know, which and there's nothing wrong with that. Because people all. some nothing people all. are forgetful, not right. on purpose, but they are forgetful. Yeah. You have some people they do that shit on purpose. Right. But you know, you have to know in your head, okay. Some of these patterns. So, these patterns, not some of them. <laughs> some of these patterns will transcribe. Uh, they going to transcribe over, and you got to have all <laughs> in your brain. All right, I'm going to have to pick up the slack right, right, here. Right, but it won't be, it's not right. like it'll be like big issues. It'll just be nuisance, like right, little stuff right, that right. will drive you crazy. 
But it'll be like a whole bunch of little stuff. But, but you it have will, to anticipate. Yeah, you have to be like, all right, if we go into business, all right, if this person does this, 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 this at home, all right, I know once we start running, I know I'm going to have, I might have to, it may be, you know, 60 40. Right. These for places, a while. these things, these patterns may not be as blatant as leaving something on the floor, mm -hmm. but it's going to be somewhere in their work yeah. pattern. It's going to be a similar scenario. Yeah. You know what I mean? So, and it's not a bad thing, yeah, but no, you no. just have to, just knowing, and, and vice you have versa. To start knowing the person. Yeah, vice versa yeah. With, with yourself. You know you. Right. You just need to know your partner to be like, right. okay, is right. this, it, right. will my partner be able to, you right. know, if, I'm not gonna say I'm a high head. Say it. I'm a high head. Right. He's not. Nope. We balance each other out. So when I get uh, riled up, mm -hmm. he knows he can. Make light of the situation. Do I get riled up a lot? Yeah. Yeah. But. <laughs> Got him. But, like I said, I take it personal when it comes to our business because that's our baby. But yeah. he's the type that can, you know, make light and balance off. Now, if you and your partner are similar, you're like, oh, yeah, you know, oh, we, we're so much alike that's why we work work in a relationship yes right. work in business not nah. one of y'all need to be able to like look you one, need to calm one, down one of y'all have to be the person that does the other thing yeah Whatever you need is. to be opposites yeah. yeah you need to be opposites like me i am when it comes to certain thing i am very uh tedious i try to stay on top of it and that's good that's yeah. that's 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 what i need yes and but when it comes to maintenance i'm not getting dirty that's him. Simple as that. Can I change the tire? No. <laughs> Can I learn? Yes. Am I? No. <laughs> because I got him. Right. You know. But what? that's the thing, man. Yeah. You know. You know. The, you doing that, and I know that. So yeah. I'm doing what I'm doing, but so I don't. I'm not going to think about what you're doing. Yeah. Because I know you're doing it. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So it's the same. You're not thinking about. It's this, 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 that I do this. That's what I'm going to do. Yeah. That's what I'm getting up to go do. Mm -hmm. you know what I mean? But you have to know that or you have to learn that. Yeah. Either either way. Either you already know it about the person yeah. or you like this person enough to learn them and develop these, yeah. you know, this consistency. So you're, it's either, it's either, way, either you already know how this person works Cause you know him from work, or you know him from just like well, here, here, here's, here's, here's just even though we talking, here's this, just like how people, you know, a lot of people when they have relationships or whatever, be at work, they have work wise and work situations, and this, that, and the third, right? Uh -huh. No, this is this is messy, right? But when people end up in them relationships and they cheating or whatever they doing on their wife, they wives or husbands or spouses, why? Because at work. I know that you're the type of person that is um, still not doing your work. I do that, so you find that you think that's attraction. Yeah. Because both of y'all is people that's not completing your task and not completing yeah, yeah, your yeah. job. Now, your wife or husband at home may be the person that's doing the extra bit, and you getting away. And now at work, y'all yeah, think y'all yeah. really compatible. But then when y'all get together... And you done got the divorce or whatever from your husband <laughs> and realize both of y'all is the same yeah. person, then you like, man, I left my husband, I left my wife for this person. But at work, you really get to yeah, see. Yeah, yeah. So that's why y'all think y'all like each other. Mm -hmm. But really, you and that other person that you in a relationship with is balancing each other. Mm -hmm. But you here at work or wherever, and you think that because how did y'all meet? Over by the uh by the uh, vending machine smoking cigarettes on what's not normal break. Yeah. Right. So people be like, yeah, but well, that's where I met. We was all we always be over here. We uh -huh. always do that. So you think that y'all yeah. are compatible, but you are. Yeah. Because that's what at work or working with a person, you gonna really find out. Yeah. Who this person is. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? So then you can and now if you want to work with this person, now I know. I know, I know you get fussy. 
Yeah. You, I know this about you. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Because we work together. Mm-hmm. I know she's fussy. Mm-hmm. So like, just like the other day when we was uh, we was sitting on the uh, I was sitting on the belt and you was over there talking to uh, Joe or whatever and uh, Brent and what's her name come walking through and and I'm standing there I was like man I said she's so funny and they like man she's just going going up. and it's like you just sitting here like. Cause I know she get fussy. I know this. <laughs> you may not know this, but yeah. I know this. So you get what I'm saying? Like you have to. At first, I couldn't. At first, I'm like man, yo, get off me when you get. Mm. But I understand your work mm-hmm. capacity. I understand how you, you know. And yeah. so, over time, you you have to develop that because when you're not being fussy, right? You might. My uh, Costco buddy, you know? Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying. <laughs> so I, I gotta get you from one capacity to yeah. another. You know what I'm saying. But mm-hmm. that's what you have to learn if you plan on partnering with your partner. Yeah. If you plan on working with your significant other. If you plan, you have to. It's and it's even though we're talking about it, mm-hmm. it's not something that can just be expressed as easily as yeah, we're yeah, saying yeah. it. Like you have to be experiencing it. You have to. You. Ha- it has to be happening to you. Yeah, and then so because no matter what, you still this person mm-hmm. to me. Yeah, and I, you know, and I may be angry or you may be angry, but I don't want to hurt you, and you don't want to hurt me. So yeah. you have to add that into it. Like, yeah. But why would she do this to me? I have to think that you mm-hmm. know what I'm saying. You have to think. Well, why would it? Why? That's my buddy. Why? Mm-hmm. Why? Why? Yeah. So now I can think. Well, that is HR business. Mm-hmm. That, you know what? That is out of pocket. You know what? You can't do that. Mm-hmm. You have to think because as HR, you're not thinking to hurt me. You're thinking to better our business or yeah. that could hurt our business. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? And that's something that it's, we still learn. Mm-hmm. And we'll, you know, to, for the foreseeable future, we'll be learning. Yeah, and working continue learning. Yeah. You know what I mean? And continue to build it. Even just having this conversation is making me learn things about it. Like, you know what? That is what we do. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That is what we do. I was, I, that's what I said. I said she's so funny. <laughs> she's I'm so a funny person. funny person. She's so funny. But, you you know, you have to see the person you with and see the person you working with mm-hmm. at the same time. Yeah. But know that, that they're different. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying, but because we work together, I know your work capacity, and then because we live together and we are together and we love each other, I know that person too. So yeah. I know okay, well she. But yeah. it takes time to get to that point. That's why, if you're gonna partner with your partner, just make sure you like that person and make mm-hmm. sure you know that individual. So in your head, you know. Okay, you you might have to do a little. You have to realize that you may have to do a little more to pick up where they're liking, and they're gonna pick up where you're liking, or whatnot. So it it it, it needs to balance. Mm-hmm. If not, you gonna lose your business in your in your and your and your friend in your friend. So you and need your to partner. Yeah. Yeah, and whatever. And if you get to that point, oh, I'm doing this, and he or she ain't doing enough or ain't doing this, then you need to sit down and think like, okay. What am I not doing that's getting done? Right. You see what I'm saying? Right. And then you you will realize like, holy crap! All right, so it, it's balanced right. in your head. You may, or at that point in time, you may feel that you're doing more, but in actuality, you're not. Now, you could be doing the most, right. and that person is is lacking. Right. But you need to be able to see that. You need right. to be able to be all right. Let me let me take a breath. And just think about it. Okay, what's being done that I'm not doing? Right. And I guarantee you, if you like that person and y'all relationship is solid, you will see that, okay, this is perfectly, it's balanced. Right. Right. You know, like it, it'll said, take, you just have to work through it and you have to see it. Like you said, you, but what you said made, you know, now I'm thinking about what you're saying makes sense. We have to look at everything about mm-hmm. this person. Is this a person you want to be in business with? Not based on you liking them personally, 
Because, like you said, we can like each other personally, but as a worker, mm-hmm. nah, y'all may not. You know, because guess what? At work, you got people who cut corners. Yeah. And yeah. at work, you got people who go far. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? So you have to you have to look at those things and say, now, as as just as two people, I love you. Now, let's leave it at that. Yeah. As a worker, you may be a different worker than you are a person around the house. Yeah. You may be a completely different person. You know what I mean? And we have to understand that. Anybody has to understand that. that yeah. That person, you know, it, but it doesn't make them bad or good. It just means maybe y'all can't do this together. Maybe yeah. you need to get somebody else. Now, with that being said, let's say we couldn't work together, but I get somebody else who worked. Mm-hmm. So, and we start a business. Now, I may still need you as my personal HR to yeah. say, you can't be my HR at work, but you can tell me, don't do this, don't do that, yeah, don't yeah. do this, because me and this person is working together, mm-hmm. and that makes me a better person with this person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You see what I'm saying? So you can, you can, you can help, yeah. especially if they're, they're your partner and you right. want to see them succeed. You can right, help. Right, right, right. But at the end of the day, you need to make sure that if you're in business or you're partnering with your partner. Make sure you just don't brush them off of, oh, they're not doing enough, they're not doing that. Take a look in the mirror or take an overall look at what you guys' business are and what you're doing. And I guarantee you, if that person, if you and that person have a solid relationship and you're partnering, that person's picking up the slack that you're not. Right. And I had, I had to learn that. I had to learn that. So, you know, that would be my advice for any any individuals who are partnering with their partner before you write them off of not doing enough uh look at the overall picture and i guarantee you they are they're doing what the, they, they should be doing and, and that's why your business is succeeding and that's why it's balanced so, right with that being said partnering with your partner boom <laughs> use that one. Of all the things on there, you could have used Listen, any of them. What we got? We got that. That's the one we're going to use. <laughs> partner with your partner. Partner with, yeah, I like that one. So, but you can put that. Oh, stop it. So you can put that on the thing? Okay. When you go to your editing, editing room. Okay, somebody sat in a, a studio and did that. Did all of that. <laughs> <laughs>